Hello guys and welcome. In this video I'm going to explain you my storage system. So I use my spec for storage. It's always nice if you zoom out a little bit. Uh, I hold control and use my mouse wheel and I'm farming. So my inventory is usually always pretty full. And what's very helpful if you want to fill many boxes is if you place them uh, on the top side of uh, whatever land you're using. And then I have a system where I basically go by uh, the list of pixels tips. So I have tier one, uh, always or and then matrix. And then again, or and matrix. And as you can see here, I have my ores. Um, my clay should be in here. And uh, then I have or tier two, or and matrix tier two, tier three and tier four. And the way I can fill this up really quickly after farm run, because um, yeah, I, I don't want to have, if, let's say I stand here, I don't always want to have to close my inventory and then open it up again. So if I'm standing down here and it's a buff, I can just quickly, uh, by remembering my system, drop everything in, close the tab and open the next one. And you will guys see how fast this actually uh, works. The only thing you need to do is remember the order of the items that you put in. Now here the tier two. So once again, I put in my ore. It's kind of like a mini game. And then here I have the other tier two. Okay, here we're actually full. So what happens if one of my chests is full? I just move them down here and um, I have uh, these land, these chests here are all full, like you can see. Uh, this is where I basically keep my other stuff. <clears throat> and yeah, once also I've used one chest, I'll just put the next one here and then I can start filling it up again. So here is the tier three stuff. And then of course the T4 already hit level 60. Uh, and yeah, this will help you significantly to be faster at farming. I actually forgot one here, but since I know my system well, and now you can see T1, T2, T3, T4. That's how I manage my storage for the things that I farm. But I also I have a system that's very similar that I use for inside my spec. So I'm using my spec mainly for the task board and I have a fairly similar system. So down, we, down we, here we have all the crops and in order to remember it slightly better I put some tiles in here. Uh, the tiles are these items, gray slab, you can get them at the decoration store. And you guys will see here, I have the pop berries, I have everything, rainbow, grumpkins, then clover. Uh, these are tatoes, these are mug chuck. And yeah, basically this system helps me to have everything that I will need here for the task board. And once again, I use uh, this view so I can later on show you also how I just drop in the items really fast. And then I have the same system for my uh, for my ores. So also the same order as we have it outside, tier 1, tier 2, tier 3, tier 4. Alright, so let's do one round of task board. I'm using the Voxels extension which tracks all my tasks in here. You can get it for free on the Chrome store and if you get premium and use my code LU, you will get one week for free. Uh, I'm going to use this as my shopping list. Also a bit nicer if you scroll out using control and your mouse wheel, you can see uh, almost everything in one place. And yeah, I will just buy all of these items real quick and then also show you how I put, uh, I don't put in the exact amount because that might take too long. So I have here rainbow tart. Let's just buy, buy a few. Then we have the marble brick. So now we're back at the spec. 
And I'm gonna put in all the deliveries here. So taking my pixels, as you can see, uh, for today we have earned already 21 pixels at an average price of 8,000 um, coins per pixel. Yesterday had slightly more. And now what I can do is I can just use my system here and put in all the access items in the boxes. So I use hotkeys shift and left click and with shift and left click I can uh, swap items inside the box and also with escape you can close chests faster and with B you can open up your inventory. So since I know Grainbow Tart, Grainbow is over here, I just need to shift left click and put it in. Then here my uh, ore chests, I have the, the gravel in here. And yeah, I can just really quick, I know there's the sap over there, coffee fruit is on the black one, tier 2 wood is here in this chest, tier 2 powder, marbleite over here. Rumpkin pie. Let's set over there. And now everything is in the right place, as you can see. And I can already check what next tasks I, I got. So for the next task, I actually have bedrock powder, orange grumpkin pie, logs, and I I now also know where I can find these inside my spec. Uh, so the orange grumpkins, I actually have 22 and I need 23, really? Well, that's a troll. So <laughs> we still will have to buy one of these. But the bedrock powder is over here in the purple chest. And I can just pick it up and give it to the task board. The logs I have over here. And yeah, that's how the system works. Clover also very easy for me to get. It's in the green chest over here. And just like that, we made a bunch of more pixels. As you can see, we are on 27 pixels now. And yeah, that's it with the video. I hope this was helpful to you guys. Thank you for watching. And yeah, see you next time.